huge wave of devs will hit the test net in May and June. The hardest month of my life and my company's life will be May because that's when we're scheduled to turn on the Plutus um, test net. And we have these professional dev companies, and each one of them is taking a large piece of work, like go build a DEX or go build a stablecoin, and they're going to go and do that. And they're going to do it in a very ruthless way. So they'll say, like, where's our documentation? Where's this? And if there's deficiencies, we have to fix it to get that to over the finish line. And then at the same time, with this huge group of people from the community who are coming in who know just enough to be dangerous. So any deficiencies or problems we have, it's not going to work for them. And we're going to get this massive wave of, hey, help us out. Let's fix this. But then the end result of that is going to be that we burn in. Plutus, and we get a really good sense of what's working, what's not working, and we fix all of that before it goes to the mainnet. The problem is that the minute this goes to the mainnet um, and applications are deployed, if you make a mistake, it's hard to change that, because if you fix it, you may break those applications and you lose immutability in that particular respect, and you may even lock user funds. So you have to have as much done as possible up front to make sure that you don't introduce a mistake. It's pivotal that as many people as possible test it, build on it, play around with it, uh, so that what we think is true is true, and we're completely happy with that design. Now, the other thing is because there's so many people that are there, the amount of bugs that are going to be discovered will likely be very high. And what we don't want to happen is the feature teams and integration teams have to move over to bug fixing and slow down feature delivery and integration, because that'll push out the timeline for delivery of the product. So. We've made some deals with some of our, our friends in the Haskell community to do surge resourcing. So they're going to come on and do nothing but bug fixing and work in parallel with the feature teams and the delivery teams and the integration teams so that both of those teams can basically work at the same time as opposed to a, a, a resource context shifting. So uh, I think that'll help with making sure that we hit our targets and our timelines that we announced. and. Uh, I think also it'll ensure that we're, we have a much higher quality product that, uh, that we launch with. But as I said, this is probably the busiest three months in our company's history, and May in particular is going to be hell.